Hi everyone! Welcome back to another video. So for today, I'll be doing a review about the Human Nature makeup products. We all know that Human Nature is a local brand. So, bakit hindi natin tangkilikin ang sariling atin, di ba? And also, they cater 100% all natural ingredients sa mga products nila. And also, cruelty-free sila. And all of these products are made in the Philippines. So, let's go to the review. I used five different human nature products sa buong mukha ko. So basically, lahat tong nasa face ko ay human nature lang. Wala akong ibang ginamit na brands. Ang ginamit ko lang ng ibang brand is brushes. First things first, ang unang ginamit ko sa aking face or sa lips rather is this one. This is their tinted lip balm. And meron akong kopya dito para basahin ko at ma-share ko sa inyo kung ano ba talaga yung each products na ginamit ko. So for this one, it's 100% natural, obviously, and they have three shades. This one is in the shade of Flame 3, according to their handbook manual. Ano ba tawag dito? Wipe on a moisturizing sheer tint for quick lip fixes on the go. Get 5 in seconds, no mirror needed. And this costs 99.75 pesos with 4 grams of product in it. So obviously, tinted lip balm and it also moisturizes your lips yung usually unang ginagamit ng mga makeup enthusiast. So, yun din yung unang kong ginamit. And it's very pigmented. Nagulat ako sa pagiging pigmented niya kasi yung ibang tinted lip balm per sheer. But this one, it's somewhat opaque naman yung color. For the ingredients of this product, mapasahin ko na lang ha. May castor seed oil, may beeswax, Cacao seed butter, coconut oil derived, sunflower seed oil, peppermint leaf essential oil, corn mint leaf essential oil, vitamin E, iron oxide, manganese violet, mica, and titanium dioxide. So obviously, wala siya paraben, all natural ingredients lang, which is good. Kasi syempre, kailangan din natin protectahan ng ating lips with harmful or chemical ingredients. As for the scent of this product, it's not overpowering. Naamoy ko yung beeswax. Naamoy ko yung konting peppermint. Pero, mas subtle siya. Kasi, kung meron kayo ng lip balm from Ilog Maria, yun, pure beeswax, yun, sobrang tapang naamoy, which I don't like. This one, subtle, okay lang. And, as for the taste, hindi ko siya ganong natikman. Or, wala siya masadong lasa. Which is good, kasi ngayon sa Ilog Maria, sobrang lakas nung amoy, nung beeswax na parang nalalasahan ko na siya. And then the next thing, or next makeup product na ginamit ko sa aking face is this Human Nature Perfect Flush Cream Tint. Ito ka agad yung ginamit ko sa aking face since hindi ako bumili ng powder blush, so cream blush. And wala sila cream concealer, cream foundation, so ito muna. According to this, obviously it's 100% natural. Cheer up your cheeks and lips with a subtle pop of color and a smooth creamy finish that hydrates your skin while giving your face a dewy, youthful look. This costs 395 pesos with 7 grams of product in it. And they have 3 shades of this which are Hibiscus, Petal, and Rosy. Yung meron ako is the Hibiscus. Tapa ba? Hibiscus, Hibiscus, whatever. And super cute tung box niya. As for the ingredients of this product, may castor seed oil din siya, may beeswax din siya, sunflower seed oil din, and almost everything is vegetable or plant-derived na ingredients. So, walang chemicals, obviously. Meron din siyang vitamin E, manganese violet, titanium dioxide, magnesium, whatever, whatever. So, obviously, walang paraben dahil nga, all natural siya. And then for the expiry date, meron siya nakalagay sa box and meron din siyang nakalagay sa product itself. So, this product is until April 27, 2019. So, bang tagal ng lifespan niya kahit wala siyang paraben. So, according to the box, kung paano siya i-apply sa face, sabi, dab three dots on both cheeks and bend with fingers. So, hindi three dots yung ginawa ko, more than three dots yung ginawa ko sa aking cheeks. Pinlend ko siya using my fingers at first, but on my left cheek, pinlend ko naman na gamitin siya with a brush. So, mas mahirap siya with a brush kasi parang mawawala yung color. Nakukuha ng brush yung pigment, so mas okay na i-blend siya using the fingers. So, gusto ko siya as a cheek tint kasi 
madali siyang i-blend, hindi siya yung nagkakaroon ng parang um, natitira yung stain na may maliit na ganun. Kung parang siya unang in-apply, na mahirap i-blend. But this one, super dali niya i-blend. I like it. Next product na ginamit ko sa aking face is this Human Nature Perfect Coverage Mineral Foundation. So, ito lang yung foundation nila. Yung dalawa is powder na lang. So, ito yung foundation. So, basically, mas makapal ang foundation sa powder. So, ito yung kinuha ko. And according to this, again, got acne scars, dark under eye circles, redness, and uneven skin tone. Human Nature's Perfect Coverage Mineral Foundation is the everyday makeup solution you're looking for. And it feels very light on your skin. And this one cost 595 pesos with 7.5 grams on it. And kung refill lang yung bibilin mo, it's 325. Same grams and may sponge kasama yung pagbinili mo refill. And according to this, may 6 shades siyang available. Ang kinuha kong shade is yung honey. So merong... Milk, Honey, Toffee, Vanilla, Almond, Caramel. So, yung tatlong sinabi ko are the yellow undertone and yung last three are fake undertone. So, basically, for Filipinas like us, yung yellow undertone yung kinukuha natin. And first, ang kunin ko dapat is yung Toffee. Since morena ako and yellow undertone, dapat yun. Pero looking at it, nung binili ko na to or nakuha ko na tong shade na to, which is Honey nga, para siyang darker na ng very light. Kaya, buti lang ito yung kinuha kasi feeling ko pag yung toothy yung nakuha ko, super dark na na parang bronzer effect. And then, nakalagay sa likod ng powder, 100% no harmful chemicals, no chemical preservatives, paraben, mineral oil, artificial dyes, or other toxic substances. And then, how to use? Apply evenly onto skin using a sponge or a brush and gliding motions. Perfect use on a moisturized face for longer lasting effect. Wala ko moisturizer sa face. Bare face lang. Fresh from shower face. Ganon. So, nung in-apply ko siya sa aking face, medyo parang hindi nga siya nag-glide easily because walang moisturizer. And I have dry skin. So, dapat nga siguro. May moisturizer. And meron siyang malaking mirror, which is nice, which is good. And then yung sponge niya, helpful naman. And then the product itself. So for the product, I feel like it's too chalky. Hindi siya yung parang medyo creamy na powder. If you get what I mean, kung meron kayo ng Maybelline na super white fresh or kahit anong foundation powder na Maybelline, gusto ko yung ganong pagka-creamy na mga ganitong powders. So medyo hindi ko siya nagustuhan. Parang ayoko siyang tawag yung foundation. Gusto ko lang siyang tawagin as a simple powder kasi ganun yung finish niya. Ganon yung texture niya. So, una kong ginawa sa aking face ay binab ko to using the sponge sa aking under eye area para matakpan yung under eye circles ko. And hindi siya ganon natakpan dahil naging grayish siya ng very light. And then, apply ko rin siya sa nose, sa chin, and then sa aking forehead. Parang to highlight. And then, I use a bigger brush to blend that all into my face. So, medyo nahirapan ako when it comes to spreading it out all over my face to blend it. Hindi ko alam kung bakit, baka super laki ng brush na ginamit ko. Pero ayun, I'm not a fan of this powder foundation. Yun lang. Next up is to bronze up my face dahil naging puti ang aking or grayish ang aking face because of the powder. I moved on in using the Mineral Matte Bronzer. So, ang kanilang Mineral Matte Bronzer looks like this. They only have one shade of this. And then this costs 445 pesos for 9 grams of product. So, mas marami siya compared to the foundation. And then, basahin na naman natin kung ano ang nakalagay dito. Kalagay, colors and contours blend a rich, warm shade of tan on your face and accentuate its crisp by drawing attention to your forehead, cheekbones, jawline, and chin. Seamless as silk. Taylor fits your face perfectly as you build a lightweight powder on your skin. Masterfully matching up to an immaculate finish as mattifying pump absorbs excess shine so your face stays smooth and fresh. So I agree naman dun sa mga sinabi niya. This one is matte. This one is seamless. And this one colors and contours my face. And I super love this. 
I highly recommend you getting this. Ang ganda niya. Feldable pa rin siya sa kahit anong skin tone. Eh wow, I just love this product. Moving on to this area of my face. Wala silang pang kilay. But then again, I chose an eyeshadow, a matte brown eyeshadow. Para pwede natin gamitin for kilay. So I have here the Perfect Eyes Mineral Eyeshadow. This one is in the shade of Earthy Beauty and they have two shades available lang sa palette na to. The other one is the Sunset Bloom. Meron yung matte pale cream eyeshadow and two shimmer shades na dark. Eh for me, mas gusto ko na yung darker shades, yung matte. So ito yung pinili ko. And also, it can double up as your eyebrow powder. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's very sleek. Black lang siya. So, meron siyang mirror up top. And meron na yung three shades. And meron siyang mini brush. Looks like this. And obviously, if you know me, I hate this kind of brushes. My sponge applicator. And meron parang brow brush. Or applicator, whatever. So, tapo na yan. So, for the eyebrows, sa unang kong ginamit is a darker shade. Then sa tail, like what I did in my previous video. And then, this middle shade, a matte subtle brown shade sa inner part sa aking brows. And okay naman siya sa aking brows. Napaka-subtle lang, napaka-simple. Okay for an everyday look. Yun nga lang napansin ko when it comes to the powders. Medyo chalky siya. Pag dinidip ko yung brow brush dun sa product, nagkakalat siya. And I hate that. Mas gusto ko nga yung mas creamier na powders rather than this super chalky. But it's very pigmented. Yun. Very pigmented tong dalawang brown shades. After the brows, eyeshadows. Obviously, ito parek product na to yung gagamitin ko when it comes to my eyeshadows. And basahin na natin ko ano nakalagay dito. From subtle to eye-catching, create the perfect look with richly pigmented Filipino skin tone friendly palettes with soft, easy to blend powder shade. I agree with the Filipino skin tone friendly palettes and also yung blendable. Napaka-blendable nila. This costs 350 pesos and it has 3.9 grams of products in it. But first, ang una kong ginamit is bumalik ako dun sa powder just to clean up my brow bone kasi nga walang matte na cream or beige eyeshadow dun sa palette. So, foundation yung ginamit ko. And then I took the middle brown shade, the matte one, to pen dun sa crease area ko para magin transition transition color siya. After I blend that in, I took a bullet brush and dip it on the darker or the darkest brown shade dun sa palette. And then, nilagay ko lang siya sa outer V ng aking eyelids. And also sa lower lashes or the lower lash line. Lastly, kinuha ko yung shimmer eyeshadow and nilagay ko siya sa inner parts ng aking lids. Pero nang ginamit ko yung brush, parang wala. Hindi siya kumakapit. Yung glitter sign kumakapit sa lids ko. So what I did is I tried using it or patting it on using my ring finger. And with my ring finger, mas pigmented siya. And then wala silang mascara. So I went ahead and put on my mascara. After that, I took again this palette and used the shimmer shade to highlight the tops of my cheekbones. Which looks like that. And ang ganda ng pagka-highlight niya sa aking cheeks. I love it so much. Na-highlight niya talaga. Ang ganda. Last but not the least, kinuha ko na naman or bumalik na naman ako dun sa lip tint. And put it all over my lips. And that is my final look. Full face using Human Nature makeup products. That is all for the five makeup products that I have from Human Nature. Isa isa hindi ko sila ulit kung ilan recommend ko ba sila or hindi. So first thing is the lip balm. Lip balm, I love it. So highly recommend it. Next up is the foundation. Well, obviously, sa first impression ko kanina, I don't like it. I don't recommend it. So. And then the bronzer. So this one I highly recommend. I love it. Ang ganda lang niya. So, you have to try this one. And then, for the eyeshadow, well, it's a so-so. Gusto ko yung dalawang matte shades, but the shimmer ang hirap niyang i-apply sa lids. 
But for highlighting your cheekbones, I like it. So, 50-50 siya. Lastly, the lip tint. I like it. I love it. I highly recommend it for the cheeks and for the lips. Very natural now. Also, if you wanna order Human Nature products, I'll have the link in the description box down below. So that is about it for my video. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thumbs up this video if you find it helpful. Comment down below ko ano yung mga gusto niyo pang i-review ko or whatever. Again, thank you very much for watching and bye! See you in my next video!